In December of 2015, our developers team published the result of an experiment to create a human-robot smart contract for achieving GPS coordinates. It was fully autonomous, without payment intermediaries and any pilots. After the release date, we made improvements for four months to achieve our main goal, guarantee a safe usage of a single airspace by multiple autonomous drones that perform tasks written in their smart contracts. In April of 2016, we had the first test for Drone Employee Project. This service provides autonomous waypoint navigation for many drones without human control. The test was successful and now I want to tell more about it. A field test was carried out in Middle Volga near the city of Taliati. We organized a promo video shooting for a motocross bike team by four autonomous drones from 3DR and the GoPro cameras were mounted on the drones. The test plan was as follows. First of all, autonomous airspace traffic controller had to receive the topography data of the area we plan to operate in. Drone employee autonomous dispatch works with high definition topography data but unfortunately we couldn't scan the territory at the moment and there was no such data for Volga region. So we used Google Maps and our own topography model with GPS navigation. We defined the borders of the flying area, the height of the waterfront and then set the forbidden zone. In our case, the safe area for people and cars. As a result, we had a 3D model of the region. For comparison, on the right you can see a more accurate model with high-definition topographic data of the park north of San Francisco prepared by Open Topography Project. The second step was to create a waypoint smart contract for each drone which specifies the GPS coordinates that need to be achieved. Drone Employee allows creating Ethereum smart contract with drones to achieve multiple waypoints on a map. Also, in a smart contract you can specify the start time, the angle of the drone, height above the ground, as well as additional actions such as drop the cargo, turning the video on and off and switching to manual control in specific area. It is important to understand that when you work with drones, you don't have to think about traffic control, as it is fully autonomous and can communicate with drones without human interaction. Basically, you create a contract with a drone that automatically registers the route with a traffic controller. If the route had such mistake as entering the forbidden area or collision with other drones, then the traffic controller will automatically find the safe flight route and pass it to the drone through the blockchain. In a test, we intentionally entered the intersection of routes and entry into a restricted area. After registering the GPS coordinates, we received corrected routes from the traffic controller for every drone and you could see them on our 3D model of the area. As you can see, Traffic controller introduced additional waypoints to avoid a collision and entering prohibited areas. And the final third step was to give the start to the motocross team at the same time when drones took off. For two days in this field test, we worked with two geographic areas, received a great new experience and most importantly achieved our goal. Drone employee software solves the problem of collision avoidance and entering forbidden areas. We proved that it is possible to organize autonomous drone bases with multiple drones in a single airspace without manual control.